lose down. We don't feel remotely full at all. So we'll probably smash another three down us and then see how we feel after that. All right, had just a little less than two kilos of mangoes for breakfast, which is absolutely huge. I normally just have like a couple of oats and it fills me up. But I just kept eating the mangoes and I just didn't really feel full. So I was like, well, I'll just keep going then. Um, but yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna have like a, probably 20 minutes, half an hour, just chilling and then go ride my bike and see how we feel. But it's weird, like I seem to eat a lot of fruit. You feel full, but I don't really feel like full as in terms of like, I can't eat anymore. But I don't feel like I'm actually like eating very many calories. But anyway, we'll see how we feel on the bike. Hopefully, you might be feel quite sprightly. All right, so just come back from a ride. Um, one and a half hours, pretty chill. Saw Hayden, which was nice, uh, and have one and a half kilos of pineapples, which I'll have now. Didn't eat anything on the ride, didn't really feel that hungry, to be honest, uh, which is quite weird. Uh, I think it's just because it was a cash ride. Uh, but anyway, that's, uh, that's what we're going to have after my ride, instead of the usual oats uh, and water and sugar, which is the classic. But anyway, well, after we smash this down, uh, probably just chill out the rest of the day. All right, so what did I think of my first raw day? It was all right, like, morning was fine. It was just lunch, I got really like hungry and just couldn't really find anything to eat. And I feel like because I just got a bit sick of bananas and I feel like if I had a blender, maybe it would have been better. Um, if I could blend some mangoes and bananas and all the rest of it up, maybe I could have consumed some more food. But like, I also didn't have dates. I guess dates are always good, but like, there's, it's quite easy to make excuses, like, <laughs> but in reality, it was more like I just didn't eat enough food. Um, and I, when I didn't plan, I was just like, yeah, let's do it, because I'm gonna have the during buffet. That was my main reason. I was like, oh, I might as well go raw for the day. It can't be that hard. Uh, my overall thoughts, like, yeah, I might do it again. Uh, people just say, like, if you go raw, obviously you don't have as much salt, so you can lose, like, your uh, water weight quite easily. So maybe that'll be useful. I don't know. Uh, but for me, like, I quite like my cooked food. Today I had a big pad thai for lunch, and I was feeling, feeling very satisfied. Um, but it's interesting, nonetheless. Like, I'm happy I did it and all the rest of it. But I was pretty moody in the afternoon. I was very undercarved. I was just like, ugh. This is just like, nah. Just didn't really feel myself. Uh, but anyway, in terms of like training, um, it would be interesting to try and do like a 20 hour week, 15 hour week and go raw and see if I can eat enough or not. But anyway, it was a good experiment. Always do enjoy doing something new. Uh, but anyway, I hope, hope this helps you if you're going raw. Uh, and if you have any like tips on going raw, like how to not be hungry the whole time and really moody, then uh, definitely leave them below because I have absolutely no idea, like really. Uh, I don't really eat like that much fruit during the day generally, so going raw was quite a shock to me. But it was all good. So anyway, cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next vid.